Online. Unarmed Security Guard Officer License Training. Course Introduction. Course Overview. Confirm Eligibility. License Process Overview and Costs. Requirements, Terms of Use. Standard of Conduct. Confirm Eligibility. Requirements, for Unarmed Security Licensure. Please carefully review the eligibility requirements, for Unarmed Security Guard Registration, before, purchasing the course. Record Expungements. If you were told that a charge or arrest would be expunged from your record, and you would not need to report the charge as an arrest, you should verify with the court clerk, or your attorney, that the record was expunged, and that you have, no arrest record, for the charge or arrest, before completing this course. Failure to report charges or arrests that were not expunged from your record, and are still listed on your TBI, and, or, FBI report, could result in the denial of your application, for a material misstatement. Requirements, for unarmed security guard registration. Be at least 18 years of age, for registration as an unarmed security guard. Be a citizen of the United States, or a resident alien. Not have been declared by any court of competent jurisdiction, incompetent by reason of mental defect or disease, unless a court of competent jurisdiction, has since declared the applicant competent. If convicted in any jurisdiction, of any of the crimes listed in this subdivision, 4. Have completed serving sentence, or court-ordered probation, at least 5 years prior to application. Requirements, for unarmed security guard registration. Conviction of the following crimes, shall disqualify an applicant, subject to the conditions stated in this section. Any felony. Any misdemeanor, involving. Shooting a firearm, or other weapon. Shoplifting. Assault and battery, or other act of violence, against persons, or property. Crimes involving the sale, manufacture, or distribution of, controlled substances, controlled substance analogs, drugs, or narcotics. Theft of property. Theft of services. Requirements, for unarmed security guard registration. Not be suffering from habitual drunkenness or narcotics addiction or dependence. Not have any disability that in the opinion of the commissioner prevents the applicant from performing the duties of a security guard, officer. Be of good moral character. Requirements for unarmed security guard registration. If you have any doubt regarding your eligibility, please do not register for the course. Contact Private Protective Services for questions regarding eligibility. 615-741-6382 Private.protective at tn.gov Department of Commerce and Insurance 500 James Robertson Parkway Davy Crockett Tower Nashville, Tennessee 37243 License Process Overview and Costs Step 1. Confirm Eligibility. This free introduction video, clearly communicates all eligibility requirements, to become an unarmed security officer in Tennessee. Please do not pay for the course, if you do not meet the requirements. Step 2. Schedule and Purchase Training. The student will be required to watch the entire video, before proceeding to the course quiz. At the completion of each video, the student will be required to pass a quiz, that is 5 questions in length, in order to proceed to the next video. Upon completion of all videos and quizzes, the student will complete the final exam, comprised of 50 multiple choice questions. The entire course, is designed to be completed in approximately 4.5 to 5 hours. By purchasing the course, the student agrees to our terms of service, return policy, and standard of conduct agreement, included in this video. Step 3. Complete coursework. Upon successful completion, the student will receive a link to a secure form, and instructions to submit the following information, to receive the official State of Tennessee Trainer's Certificate. First, and last name. Middle initial. Social security number. Email address. The official State of Tennessee Trainer's Certificate, will be delivered to the student via email, within 24 hours of receipt. Step 4. 
complete license process. Please review the step-by-step -step guide to complete the license process upon course completion, located on our resources page. This guide includes step-by-step -step instructions for Obtaining the State of Tennessee Trainer's Certificate Creating a passport-style photo with your phone Scheduling an electronic fingerprinting appointment Preparing documents for submission Creating a State of Tennessee Core Account Submitting application through Core website and paying fee Total Cost Summary $60 Online Unarmed Course $35.15 Electronic Fingerprinting $70 State of Tennessee License Fee $165.15 Total Cost Requirements Terms of Use By purchasing this course, you affirm that you can read, write, and comprehend standard English text can speak and comprehend the English language are eligible for unarmed security guard officer training in accordance with the state of Tennessee private protective services requirements are eligible to work in the state of Tennessee and meet all citizenship eligibility requirements in accordance with the state of Tennessee private protective services requirements unarmed students are required to pass a multiple choice test scoring equal to or greater than 70% Return Policy All sales are final. This is a non-refundable course access fee. We do not offer exchanges, returns, or refunds of any kind. All sales of products and services are final. All online students will have access to complete the course for 30 days from the date of purchase. It is the responsibility of the trainee to submit the application to the state of Tennessee along with the applicable fee. By making a purchase, you agree to our return policy. Standard of Conduct If a student is found to have not been the person who completed all the coursework, quizzes, and or final exam, the penalty may include, but is not limited to, expulsion, permanent foreclosure from future classes, forfeiture of the course completion certificate, or all of the above, in accordance with Alliance Training and Testing LLC, Standard of Conduct. If applicable, a letter notifying the student's sponsoring company or organization of the individual's misconduct will be sent by Alliance Training and Testing LLC to the appropriate official. All course activity is monitored and recorded. The system logs every bit of activity from the time you start the course until completion. When you purchase the course, when you received access, every time you sign in or out, when you completed the course, when you started a video, how much total time you spent watching the video, down to the second, when you completed watching a video, for each and every video, when you started a quiz or exam, how many times you retook the quiz, what the grade was, for each and every attempt. All activity is recorded. The state of Tennessee mandates that the course is four hours in length. All students are required to watch every video in the course from the beginning of the video to the end of the video without manipulation for each and every video to meet the state of Tennessee requirements. Any attempt to manipulate the video speed and or reduce the video playing time, such as skipping ahead, fast forwarding or other unacceptable activity, to reduce the video playing time is in violation of the standard of conduct agreement and will be grounds for immediate expulsion. All violations of our standard of conduct will be immediately reported directly to the state of Tennessee Private Protective Services. Alliance Training and Testing LLC will formally request that the student's unarmed license be immediately suspended and or revoked for violating our standard of conduct. By purchasing this course, you agree that completion of this entire course, related quizzes, and final examination, will be an individual effort. You understand if you are expelled from the course for any violation, you will not receive a refund. Introduction complete. 